Hello everyone, welcome back to Midtad Gaming. My name is Roland and today I will be doing a different video. I'm gonna do a tutorial on how to watch replays of the matches. Um, whether it is demos from uh, Face It or from the official matches on HLTV. I'm gonna show you how to run it today. I'm gonna do this video because I had a number of people ask me how to watch demos. So, I'm just gonna do it baby. So. And that can help, you know, if you want to watch some demos, you can also learn new stuff. You can steal things that you see from the pro players and you don't have to go through the process of playing the game years and years to get to the same conclusions. So that's a very good, very good thing to do if you want to improve your game, obviously. So we're going to start on, I don't know, let's, let's see, let's just switch this so you can see my desktop. It should be working now, yes. Okay, you can see my desktop now. So, what I usually do... Uh, here you go. Just open on the website, HLTV. You, first off, you have to download the demo, right? So, go to the matches. Actually, the results. You can see here all the results from the previous matches. Let's say, I don't know. I want to watch MIBR against North. Now, you download the demo. You just hit download. I have... I think I have a few demos here downloaded, right? Yeah, right. This is a demo, right? This is a highlight of mine, it doesn't matter. So let's see this let's say this is the demo that you have downloaded, okay? Now you have to unpack it in case you don't have a unpacking program, but you should have. I think every PC has one. Just download WinRAR. Uh It's free from the official website, I think, yeah. So here it is, you just go here, download WinRAR, uh, whatever language is best for you. And then after you have installed it, you just extract, you know, extract to, because then it'll extract it into a folder and that's much easier to see. Um, there you go. Now that we have that, let's say, you just change the name of the demo because it's much easier for you. Let's say we change the name for one. Good. Now, we copy this one. Uh, I'm gonna go step by step here. You go into this PC, C, Program Files, or wherever your Steam is installed. Steam Apps, uh, Steam. Steam Apps, Common, uh, this one, and C Strike. So this is it. This is the path that you're looking for in case your Steam is uh, installed into, uh, into the default the default space right so this is it in case you want to do that and you just paste the file here and this is it after you've done that go back to cs which i'm gonna let me see if i don't think you can see that one if i go on cs yeah it's a black screen so i'm gonna have to change something in my in obs i'm doing this live on stream by the way guys so in case you're wondering why i'm a little bit underprepared that's why so we're in cs now you can see we are here. Okay, and now you just play the demo and you type in play demo one because that's the name that we have given the file, remember, we, that we've placed into the into the folder that I told you. And now the demo is here. So once you you've done that, <clears throat> that's it. You just pl press click in order to move the players. If you want to watch them from a different view other than first person, for some reason, you use the scroll. You see, you can see them like this. You use the scroll back and forth. Uh, with the R, the R button, you can pull up and pull off the bars. And I think also with the X, yeah, X is the the button which, which you can turn on and off the X-ray in case you, you want to do that for some reason. I usually do my demos without an x-ray because then it uh, it is more uh, it's more realistic on what you see you know compared to what the player sees it's himself when you when you watch the replays so this is how it is uh, I made a highlight in this video in this demo at 7 7 14 let's see it I want to see it just so it stays in this video it was 7 14 right yes. 
So this is like if you want to press up, push up this, you see the demo playback where you can scroll back and forth. You just have to press shift, keep shift pressed and then F2. And that's how you can pop it up. Pop it up and down, go fast forward if you want to see a certain round, if you, you're watching yourself or something like that. So let's see if I can see the highlight here. Made a highlight, it's seventh. Yeah, this should be the round. So let's see what I did here. Let's see if they cried a lot. Ooh. I never actually watched myself on a demo to like study my movements to see if they're any good. If they're potato movements or, or not. Okay, that's decent. A little bit too wide. But I got my first guy here. So it's a three on four now. Ah, uh, this, this, this jumping around is not very good. My jumping is not that clean. Okay, so it's a one on three now. From my part. So because it's a highlight, you might predict what was, what's gonna happen. I really thought I had this guy here. I still remember saying that to my mates. Sexy AK, by the way, Roland. Oh, thank you. <laughs> okay. It's still a one on three. I still have 45 seconds. One is in B, two are short. No, two are CT, actually. Is this guy short or city? Yeah, he's short. What were you thinking sitting there? Take the fight. Yeah, he wasn't expecting that. <laughs> he was expecting me to push on site already, but I stood there. So there's one more left. Uh, uh. Heart attack situation, ladies and gentlemen. But watch this. He's in already at this point. I saw his head. I, he didn't see me, so he didn't. Ha he had no idea where I was. And booyah! <laughs> With the last bullets, by the way, I had still more, two more in the mag. Okay, that was cool. Now, that's how you watch a demo. That's how you go f back and forth and use different setups. Uh, in accordance with what you want to use now if you want to play a let me go back on the desktop here if you want to watch a face it demo like you guys have been asking me how do I get those matches and stuff like that let's say you want to I'm not gonna put in an actual let's say you want to see Chuck Norris's face it profile and see his matches okay so let's google Chuck Norris Let's see if he has a if he has a uh, face it profile. But obviously, instead of Chuck Norris, you can type in whatever player you want to see. So if you want to see the vice, you just put that in. If you want to see simple Nico, so on and so forth. Yeah, there's obviously a guy named Chuck Norris. So Chuck Norris, you're famous now. Okay, Chuck Norris is French. Uh, so this is the front page, right? Usually, if it's the official player that you want to watch, they have a little sign here that says it's verified. So let's, I'm going to give you a quick example. Let's say I want to see, I don't know, Neo. This is going to be tough because there are multiple Neos. Okay, this is Neo. Best player ever to touch the mouse. <laughs> here he is. If you want to see one of his matches, you just go on stats. Let's see. And here he has the, the last few matches that he've, he've played. Uh, so you just go like, let's go and see this one. Go to match room. Here you can see the scoreboard if you're interested in it or not. Oh, he Neo dominated. I should I should do I should do a demo with, with him. Whatever. Here he is. So if you want to download the match, you just go overview and click watch match. And that will automatically download you the file. And then after you have the file, where's the file? Here it is. Okay, it just finished download. You, you do the same steps as I told you before, okay? You unzip it, you put it into the directory that I told you in this one. 
and then you play the demo, okay? Uh, okay, that's it, right? That's it. That's it, that's it. Let's put this back to Counter-Strike. Okay, guys, that was my tutorial on how to watch demos, whether is it's HLTV or it's Face It. You can find now your favorite players and stuff like that, and you can stop asking me that question over and over and over again. I hope this 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 helps all of you. Um, I wish everybody a lovely day, lovely evening, lovely morning, lovely whatever time it is at your place. I'll see you again tomorrow. Until then, stay strong.